Okay, to build our or to create the installer for our application for our, or for our game, we need an Eno setup compiler. So this software will enable you to package an installer for your application. So the link for the installer or the website of this software, I'll be um, attaching it to the description box. So you, you just have to read and follow the steps there on how to install this software. So that's the first step. You have you need to have the Eno setup compiler. And then we're gonna make a copy of this one. Um, copy of the director of uh, directory of our game. So I'm just gonna simply paste it in here. So let her catch copy. And we're just gonna make some modifications here inside um, the letter catch data and mono bleeding edge. So let's copy the name, rename, control C, and then act, open letter catch data. And here, click new folder and paste the name that we have just copied and control A to select it all except for this folder that we have just made. And then drag all the files inside there. And we're good. And next for the mono bleeding edge, we're just, we're gonna do the same. So new folder, oops, mono bleeding edge, rename, control C, open it, and new folder, and control uh, paste or control V, and then we're gonna um, move these two files inside this mono bleeding edge folder. So that's it, that's the modification for this letter catch copy directory, and then we're gonna open now the Eno setup compiler and then create a new script okay and next and then the letter the name of our game application name letter catch and then version 1.0 uh, if you have a company or if you have a brand you can type it inside here so for me tech ads and if you have a website you can also include it here as well since I don't have any, so I'm just gonna leave it blank. And then next, we're not gonna change anything in this section. And here we're gonna browse the executable file of our game. So browse, head over to the copy, um, the copy directory of our letter catch. So letter catch copy. And this is the executable file, open. And then we're gonna add file, and that is the Unity Handler, handler exe and unitary player dll and open and then add folder so we're gonna head over again to our copy directory or the duplicate directory open this one and then open um hit this drop down button here and select the first letter catch data yes and then add folder um, the next folder that we will be adding is, is so head over again to the letter catch copy and this one mono bleeding edge the first one not this one the first and okay and select yes yeah, select yes and next and then we're just gonna set it as default next again and if you have a license file you can just browse it and include it in this one and information file shown before installation and after the installation. Uh, since we don't have that, we're just gonna leave it blank. Next, and then here we're gonna select ask the user to choose the install mode at startup. Next, and then English, I'm just gonna select English and the output folder, browse. I'm gonna select the duplicate copy again of the directory and the name. So this name will be the name of the installer itself. Letter catch catch set up um, 64 bit operating system version 1.0. Icon file, we don't have that, so we're just gonna leave it blank and I don't want to set any password. Next and then next and finish. And yeah, would you like to compile the script now? I would like to compile the script now. And yes, I would like to uh, save a script before compiling. So let's just name it script one. 
and we're just gonna wait to or we're gonna wait the Eno setup to build our installer and then after that we're gonna try to install this it to uh, in our PC or in my PC and see if our building or the setup is made was made um, correctly Okay, no errors and we're just gonna close this one and head over to your letter catch copy where we um, where we put the installer and there we have it we have your letter catch set up 64 bit operating system version 1.0.exe so let's try to install that in our PC um, install for me only Next, create a desktop shortcut. Next, and install. So I'll click finish. And let's try to run our application. So was, as you can see, we have now here a shortcut for our letter catch. And as well as here, if you yeah, letter catch, it is an app installed in your uh, computer. So let's open it now. And voila, it is now installed in our PC. So we can now play the game and you can share it as well to your friends. So make sure, Techians, that you will follow thoroughly the steps that I sh that I shown you in this video. So we, we don't want to play the game again. We're just simply going to quit it. Uh, quit. And there we have it. We have now the letter catch game with um, an exported directory and an installer so you can just share this to your friends via google drive or usb however you want however you want to share it so that's it that's our game and for our last video i'll just be sharing you uh, where i got the idea in making this game i'm just going to give credit to that guy and everything um, so that's it. So thank you for watching.